Here's what's coming up in today's news brief. A ruling was made Tuesday evening after an officer involved attack took place over the weekend. Stay with us. We have the details. It's time for your Vicksburg Daily News Brief, brought to you by your friends at Cook Tractor Company. Now's the perfect time to check out the complete line of zero turns at Cook Tractor Company on Highway 80. Visit them online at cooktractorco.com or give them a call today at 601-TRACTOR. Good evening, I'm Marcus James, and thank you for joining us for this evening's News Brief. The wait is over. In a recent post on social media, Trident Holding LLC announced Captain D's in Vicksburg would open Wednesday, December 29th. Now this comes after the restaurant had been closed for five months due to a fire back in July. And in our next story, a young man is now recovering from a non-critical injury after being shot in the face outside of a Utica home on Monday night. Frederick McGriggs was visiting a home on Lee Davis Circle when at around 8 p.m. an unknown man approached the home and fired several shots. Now, McGriggs was struck in the face by one of the bullets. Hines County deputies reported that another man that was outside the home with McGriggs at the time of the shooting was not wounded. Now, the shooter has not yet been identified, but if you have any information leading to who that shooter is, you're asked to call Hines County Sheriff's Office. And in our top story for the evening, a VPD officer is now on a 15 day suspension after viral video showed excessive force. Now the officer involved in the viral video taken in downtown Vicksburg early this week, he's been suspended for 15 days. Investigator Eddie Colbert was given a 15 day suspension without pay to be followed with a 45 day probationary period. When he returns from his suspension, he is to complete a course on anger management. Now, other officers involved at the scene were given a one day suspension. To see these stories and more, you can head over to our website at VicksburgNews.com. Stay with us, we'll be right back. How goes the car shopping? We found the one, just waiting on financing. Oh, there it is, approved. That was quick. How'd you do that? That reminds me, I need to pay my water bill. Oh, you guys need money for lunch today. Great, I don't have to split the check. How did you do that? Did he buy a boat? How did you do that? <gasps> Who do you bank with? Mutual, mutual credit, credit union. union. Where are you going? To set up an account with Mutual Credit Union. <laughs> you Use the app. Mutual Credit Union, banking that comes to you because there should be nothing between you and your money. Warren Central High School girls basketball team got a big win on Tuesday as they took down Hillcrest. The team was led by Jayla Smith who scored 14 on the night. And on the boys side, Warren Central grabbed a 50-45 win over Tyler Town. The team was led by Taylor Mitchell who scored 15 points on the night along with his 6th assist. chance of showers and thunderstorms with the high near 80 and the low near 64. Thursday we have a 20% chance of showers with the high near 78 and the low near 64. And Friday we have a 40% chance of showers and thunderstorms with the No birthdays reported today, but if you have them, happy birthday to you. And if you know of one, send them in to birthdays at vicksburgnews.com. And that's going to do it for this edition of your Vicksburg Daily News Briefing. Thank you for listening.